Hi guys! Welcome back to RV Realty PH. For today's video, we will have a very special house tour. It's a to sa pinakamagandang houses here in Rizal that's overlooking the Manila Bay. And then of course, meron din tayong city view. So, let's check it. Yeah, and so, this is a three-story modern house here in Taytay, Rizal. So, ano pang hinihintay natin? Tara! Tara guys, pasok tayo. This is the pedestrian door. And this is made of mahogany wood. Tapos meron siyang metal frame. And then, this is the main door. Wait lang ha. Sara muna natin. Ayan. So this is tangkili wood. So, ang ganda ng pagkakagawa ng ating doors dito. Ayan. Pero before we go inside, let's appreciate first the outdoor. Kasi... It is ito sa mga advantage or selling points of this property. Napakaganda ng outdoor space mo with this one. This one is the front part of your property. So, pwede siyang gawing garden. Actually, one more idea. Pwede siyang gawing pool. Napakaganda kasi it's overlooking city view, which is the Ortigas. And then, of course, you have the Laguna de Bay. Sorry, not Manila Bay. Laguna de Bay. Laguna de Bay yan. Ayan, napakaganda nito. And it's very spacious, ha? And then, kung mapapansin nyo, on your right side, this is a two-car port. Uh, meron lang tayong five stairs going down. Five steps going down. That's your two-car port na merong massive mahogany gate. Napakaganda ng detalye ng gate natin. Check muna natin before we go inside. So, mo, solid, mahogany napakaganda it's very industrial it's very modern pero yun super high quality actually this house is really good quality yung lalo yung loob if you see it later napakaganda nito okay so that's the garden and then meron tayong uh, very spacious ay nakalak yan so this is one is an alfresco area. So, meron tayong glass door papunta sa ating living area. Pero, may alfresco pa kayo dito. So, kung maglalagay kayo ng pool dyan sa garden, di ba? Ang ganda, may alfresco ka dito, dining. Maglagay ka lang ng round table, two chairs. Sightseeing ka lang, napakaganda. So, before we head inside the house, uh, meron pa rin tayong garden on this side. This is uh, your left side. Tapos may yan, may pathway siya papunta sa ating service area. So, meron na siyang plants ngayon. Actually, bamboo. I think these are called Chinese bamboo. Ang galing ng ating videographer, Mr. BJ Oliva. O Narrative Studios. Chinese bamboo. Napakaganda niya. Contrast well with the gray. This is gray, di ba? Oh, this is gray walls. Yeah, perimeter walls. And then, of course, the facade of the house are WPC. So, looks like wood but very durable. WPC. And then, this is our main door. Tangile main door na meron siyang digital lock. Ayun na, nalock ko na. <laughs> Let's go inside. Come on. Yeah, so right upon entering this very nice house. Ito ang ating magiging receiving area or pwede nyo rin gawing living room. Pero kasi this house is very special. Meron tayong third floor na pwede gawing living area. So pwedeng ito yung receiving area lang for your guest. Diba? Lagi ka lang ng couch dito. Tapos meron pa siyang sliding glass windows here. Na pag in-open mo to, papasok na yung natural air. Ayan, di ba? Kung nagtitipid kayo sa aircon. Kasi ang lamig po dito. It's one of the higher points or one of the highest points in Taytay Rizal. Napakaganda. Ayan, ang lamig. 4 p.m. pero sobrang mahangin. So, this is the glass door going to our alfresco area. 
na-open po siya ng tuluyan para siyang indoor-outdoor area. Napakaganda po. Kasi it's interconnected. So, kapag may malaki kayo, if you have big parties, you want to accommodate all the guests like seamlessly, indoor-outdoor, this is the perfect spot. Kung ayaw nyo naman maglagay ng pool, you can just extend the dining area here. Panalong-panalo po ito. Lalo po sa mga big families or you have a lot of friends. It's super nice. And then of course, for the ceiling, we have the very nice decorative lighting and of course, a lot of pin lights and cove lighting as well. Coming from the receiving area, this is gonna be your dining area. So, ang luwag po nito. Kahit 8 to 10 seater table, kasha dito, yung long table. And then you have this massive uh, floor to ceiling glass window here. Diba? Na overlooking the city and of course, Laguna de Bay. Napakaganda po na. Actually, kalahati po ng bayad nyo dito because of the view. Very, how should I say it? Immaculate yung view niya. And then, meron din tayong uh, decorative lighting para sa ating dining area. Then, we head into the proper kitchen. For the proper kitchen, uh, marami po tayong built-in kitchen cabinets. It's made out of marine plywood and then Napakaganda po ng quality niyan. Ibig sabihin, pag marine plywood, lifetime po natin pwedeng magamit niyan. Kasi it's one of the higher quality when it comes to kitchen cabinets. Kasi siya yung mga pwedeng mabasa. Or pwede kahit. Kaya siya perfect for kitchen. And then of course, it's soft close. O diba? Napakaganda. And then the backsplash goes well with the... Uh, countertop natin, the quartz countertop, and then you have this iconic black, matte black double sink. And then, pagdating po dito, we have induction cooker. May kasama na po kayo induction cooker. And then you have this windows. Ang kagandahan po nito, itong windows na to, is connected to the service kitchen. So, pwede talagang pag nagluto doon, dito tayo mag-aabot and then dyan na natin iahanda. So, it's really perfect for uh, yung mga may hiling magkaroon mag-gatherings or diba, magpa-party sa bahay. Sa bagay, <laughs> kung ganito ko ganda po yung bahay nyo, talagang gusto nyo kayo lagi mag-host ng party. And then, of course, meron pa rin tayong decorative lighting dito sa ating kitchen. Diba? Very seamless pero ganda ng dating niya. On this side naman, on your right side, kasha po ang side-by-side -side na uh, refrigerator dito. So, actually, kasha yung mga 6 foot na ref dito. Kasi ano po ako eh, 5'11. Medyo. <laughs> so, 5'6. So, kasha po yung mga 6 foot na uh, ref dito. Yan. And then, of course, ang dami po talaga nating storage perfect for kitchen talaga. Yan, napakaraming storage. Floor, ano po yan? Lahat ng pwedeng lagyan. Lagyan nila. Then, we have a door here going towards our service kitchen and of course, the parking area. All the doors, all the doors for the house, I mean, the house are tangili wood and then, lahat naman ng outdoor gate natin are mahogany wood. Yan. So, this one is going to the service area. Meron sa lili po tayong uh, maids room and they have their own toilet and bath. Medyo, ano pa lang, medyo, <laughs> hindi pa masyadong malinis. Pero, this is the maids or service quarters and then they have their own toilet. And then, this one is the service area, service kitchen. Ito yung kaninang pwede nyo iabot yung pagkain doon. So, pwede kayo maglagay ng another uh, heavy-duty cooking equipment nyo dito. Actually, may isa pa akong idea. Pwede kayo maglagay ng smoker or griller dito. Di ba? Diyan sa gilid, oh. Nag-grill ka. Kung ayaw nyo sa harapan, 
sa garden, pwede rin dito. Then, of course, meron tayong double sink. This one, the, ito po ang ating uh, water pressure tank. So, wala po kayong dapat ipag-alala sa water pressure. Napakalapit po natin sa tanke ng tubig. And, the pressure controlled po yan. So, hindi po kayo mawawala ng tubig. Ito na rin ang ating laundry area. So, balik tayo sa loob. Of course, before heading into the second floor, meron tayong powder room dito sa ground floor. Siyempre, pag marami kang guest, di ba? Kailangan meron ka sariling toilet here. And the toilet is really well placed. It's, on, it's under the staircase, pero Diba? Gets the job done. You have the water closet. Very nice. And then you have the matte black na uh, bidet. <laughs> Ang ating paborito. And then of course, your sink and faucet. Ayan. Oh, may tubig na. Diba? Ang kita-kita nyo guys. Ayan. So, this is our powder room. And then, meron pa tayong storage area dito. Sulot talaga yung pagkakagawa. Actually, seasoned uh, developer na po kasing gumawa nito. Ibig sabihin, they're very experienced, well experienced pagdating sa paggawa ng mga bahay. Kaya kung makikita nyo, lahat ng detalye, napakaganda. These are all, the glass staircase are all tempered glass. And then, yung pinaka staircase natin are tangile wood. So, head to the second floor. here at the second floor, kung mababansin nyo, meron pa rin tayong space dito which can be display area kung ano po yung mga hilig nyo. And then this one, syempre, this is the trademark of our property. The view. That's why, kaya simula ground floor hanggang third floor yan, meron tayong floor to ceiling na ganito. Let's head into the first bedroom. For our first bedroom, um, this is around 1, 2, 3, 3 by 5, uh, 15, to, again, 15 to 17 square meters. Maluwag po siya. And then, of course, you have, oh, ayan lamig. Panalo. The air, wala ka pang kapitbahay. And then, this is the, ano, ito yung medyo cooler bedroom kasi hindi siya nakatapad sa sunset. Pero nonetheless, lahat naman siya very well ventilated. And then, of course, each bedroom has its own toilet and bath. That's very good. Diba? Hindi nag-aagawan sa toilet ang ating mga anak, pati tayo. So, this one, ang finishes natin, matte black for the rain shower. And then, you have the glass enclosure then meron kang towel wrap and then the lava 
the water closet, and then of course your sink and faucet here. Most likely, this is gonna be your kid's bedroom. Diba? Kung marami kayong anak, dalawang anak ka siya dito. And then, ang kagandahan dito, the ceilings are very nice. Kasama na po lahat ng decorative lighting natin. Ang closet po natin is here. So, yeah. I'll just close the door. This is the closet. Marine plywood din po lahat ng uh, built-in closet natin. Kaya, it's very durable. High quality. The finishes of the house are really nice. Sarado ko lang ito. Ayan. Ayan. So, ang kagandahan, meron pa tayong isang side na huh, ang lamig. Sobrang ganda po. Ayan. So, kung meron pa po kayong gusto kita, no, just comment down below. Before heading into the second bedroom, meron po tayong parang display area dito. Actually, very wise use of space. And then, of course, meron pa rin tayong cabinets dito, storage, di ba? Or yung mga religious, uh, kumbaga kung ano po yung religion nyo, usually pwede po dito yun. Yung mga altar natin, sila ninyo, pwede po dito. And then, this is our second bedroom. Wow, ang ganda po ng ating decorative lighting. Yan. And then, yun nga, ang isa pa sa property na to, ang trademark niya, napakarami talaga ng windows. Gaganda ng ating window placement. This one naman overlooks the carport, two carport, and then of course, the immaculate view of Laguna de Bay, and of course, the city view of Ortiz gas and BGC. Ayan. And then on your left side, sorry, katabi po na ito, meron po tayong um, of course, the closet and the mirror here for, syempre, yung mga uh, kumbaga vanity area natin. Meron na tayo dito. So, chair na lang yung kulang nyo. All bedrooms pala have Provision for split type AC. And then, this is your toilet and bath. The, actually, the toilet and bath are standard dun sa first bedroom natin, tsaka dito. Almost same naman po yung finishes. And the size is about mga 4 square meters. Yan. So, maluwag na po siya, lalo kung isang bata lang naman. Now, let's head into the primary bedroom, the main event. Actually, second to the main event to, meron pang isang mas maganda later. Yan, iba naman po yung decorative lighting natin dito. Pero napakaganda rin ang pagkakapili na ito. And then, of course, this is where your queen size or king size bed. Dito natin ilalagay. And then, meron pa rin tayo mga display rack dito on this side. Ayan. Most likely, the TV is gonna be on that wall. Ayan. Ito kasi yung parang blank canvas mo. Diba? So, dito yung ating TV. Doon, tayo mamaya. That's the walk-in closet. And then, of course, your unsweet toilet and bath. Let's just check the Masters or Primary Balcony. Wow, ganda na ito. Napakaluwag po ng balcony for the Masters bedroom. And of course, the finishes. Ano ba? The view. The size of the balcony is around 8, 9, mga ganun, 8 square meters. Maluwag po siya. And actually, dahil it's covered, napakaganda niyang gawa ng or lagyan ng uh, round table, two chairs. Actually, pwede rin dito yung hamo. 
if you're familiar with hammock, napakaganda nun yung nakasabit lang. And then, of course, pag medyo pababa na yung araw, medyo mas maganda siya. Konti na lang, bababa na yan. <laughs> Ngayon, let's check the walk-in closet. And of course, the master's toilet and bath. So, this is the semi-walk-in. Yan, parang pa-walk-in siya. Pero this is the closet. Floor to ceiling din siya, pero sliding na po ang ginamit. Very well thought of. Kasi pag dibukas na gano'n, it takes up space pa. Kaya maganda rin na sliding na ang ating closet. And of course, marine plywood pa rin po yung gamit. And then on your left side, there's a massive mirror here. And then, dito na yung parang vanity area ng ating master's bedroom. Dito kay misis lahat. <laughs> Ikaw si Mr. Dito, walang sa gilid. Nag-aayos ka. Pero the rest, that's for our lovely wives. And then, this is the master's toilet and bath. Meron na tayo enclosed shower with the rain shower. Same finishes po as the first two bedrooms, ah, uh, two bathrooms. Pero this one, pa-square po siya. Yung kanina, medyo pa-rectangle. And then, of course, ang ating paboritong area. Hi guys, welcome to the third floor. For me, this is the crown jewel of the property. Napakaganda nitong area na to. So, right now it's open. So, open, big open space siya. Pero kasi, ang dami mong pwedeng gawin dito. Pwede siyang gawing malaking living room. Isang buong living room to. Or, pwedeng ito yung gawin yung master's bedroom. You can just have an enclosure here. Ayan. Meron ka pa rin floor to ceiling glass on your right side. Ayan. Lagyan mo lang ito ng yung mga electric curtains. Napakaganda nito. And then, if it's gonna be your master's bedroom, napakaluwag po nito. This is around the whole area. Siguro mga 7 by 8. 45, 50 square meters. Pakaluwag niya. Yan. And then of course, meron pa rin tayong mga openable glass windows here. You know, ang lamig. Yan. Meron din tayo on this side. And then, meron pa tayo this on the back side. Pero ang kagandahan dito, meron pa tayong toilet and bath. So, maganda talaga siyang gawing master's bedroom. ba? Meron man toilet and bath. If you want to upgrade this, medyo luwagan mo ng konti, pwede. Tapos, napakalaki pa nung space mo sa labas. Napakalaki ng inyo master's bedroom. Actually, may client kami before. Nag-tripping. 
Medyo, alam mo yun, medyo nabibitin sa master's bedroom. Ito, yung buong third floor, pwede mong gawing, aside from the outdoor, ha, pwede mong gawing master's bedroom. Di ba? Isarado mo lang to, lagyan mo ng partition dito. Then you still have a small study area here. Panalong, panalong. And then of course, you have this massive outdoor balcony area. Whew. This is Brazil. <laughs> Ayan, hindi po. This is Taytay Rizal. Ayan, napakaganda ng Taytay. Kala mo nasa Tagaytay ka na. Pero without the three-hour drive from Metro Manila. Ito siguro mga one hour coming from Ortigas with traffic na yun. Pero pag walang traffic, kaya actually ng mga 30 minutes. Pero kung may traffic, kaya mga one hour. Yan, nandun ka na sa Ortigas. The size of this balcony, mga 5 by mga ganun, 50 square meters. Napakaluwag. Dito, pwede nyo rin i-host yung mga party nyo, di ba? Usually, yung mga New Year's party, uh, Christmas party, kung negosyante kayo, pwede nyo imbitahan dito lahat ng colleagues nyo or kung ano man yung groups na meron kayo. Pwede nga dito mag-barbecue, eh, di ba? Yung mga smoker barbecue. Then, meron ka lang long table dito. And then, on the other side, you still have a service kitchen here which is very useful lalo pag may mga event tayo di ba? gugas ng kamay gugas ng plates and everything dito na siya and it's overlooking everything panalong panalo. wala na ako iba na sabi panalo na lang pero sa totoo napakaganda nito Recap lang tayo guys for this house tour. So this property stands on a 189 square meter lot area with a floor area of 350 square meters. We have two carport and then we have three to four bedrooms. Yung fourth bedroom nyo po pwede gawin dito sa malaking malaking third floor. And then we also have four toilet and bath and then we have a powder room on the ground floor. The asking price for this property is just 28 million pesos for this very beautiful house with an immaculate view. Pero ang kagandahan po dyan, it's still negotiable. If you have inquiries, please call us on the numbers below. For our OFW subscribers, please message us on Viber and WhatsApp. Please follow us on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, and of course, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Malapit na po kaming mag 2,000 subscribers. So, maraming salamat. If you want this kind of house tours or kung meron po kayong mga comment, please let us know on the comment section below. Isa-isa po namin yung binabasa. Maraming salamat and see you on the next one.